Hey everybody, what's up? Today we are looking at this John Deere 909K. You may remember I did another video on this, this thing. So, in that video, you know, I just bashed the thing. I said, you know, I don't know how to use it. So then, today I come in. I just took a week vacation. So then I come back to farm and I hop in. I had a tiger kid over here. And I was, my map was lagged, so I was going to sell a bunch of stuff. So I was looking at it, and I was like, ah, oh, we'll just give this thing one last try. So I jumped to the tiger cat, and I cut a tree down right away. And I was like, ah, oh, I got the hang of it. So, anyways, this is a very nice mod. Uh, the detail is just amazing on this mod. Uh, a lot more excited to use this mod now that I know how to use it. But, yeah, the detail is really good. I, I got this mod from Facebook. You can never find this on a public website. Um, at least I don't think we could. Um. But yeah, this thing's really detailed. These people that do all this logging, they're hardcore. They don't they don't stop for anything. They put all the details in. I really like that they even have you know feet back two hundred feet, three hundred feet. They got all the little details here. It's really nice to see a nice detailed mod. In the world of having so many junk mods. So like I thought this, I downloaded it. And you would think it would just be like a big old box. So you usually skimp out on this stuff. There's a fire box on there, fire cam on there, fire on there. There you go. And all, they did all the details. And they got the door for the radiator, I believe. The exhaust looks very nice. There's a huge hood on this thing. These hoods, I think, they tip backwards. They got like steps on them, climb up on them. They're huge. These machines are massive in real life. The uh, inside of the cab is pretty nice. It's not great, but it does a job. I think it was from. Uh, yeah, it's from North Star Land Clearing Development. That's where I got this thing. But, anyways, enough talking about it. Um, this is a light bar, I believe. I think that's six. Yeah, six turns on a light bar. A lot of lights on this thing. I don't really know what the light on the left side is for. I guess when you're using this thing, you probably swing to the left. I'm no expert. Uh, very nice swing, too, though. Kind of like the cat excavator, if you've seen my videos on that. This thing, it goes, and then it kind of stops, it slows down, instead of just an abrupt stop. I like it. This thing just weighs a ton, too. It, it, it is probably the heaviest thing I've ever moved in farm uh, You can also tilt the cat. I just realized it's sitting sideways. I was like, what? Yeah, this is very heavy. You're not tipping this thing over. Uh, I can you can only move it with that 55 ton Fontaine trailer too. Anything less than my work. But anyways, let's cut some trees. I'll show you the technique that I figured out. So you come up to the tree, and I thought you had to cut first. No, you don't cut it first. What you do, gotta have it like angled like that, kinda. Come up to it. I gotta turn it on first. Come up to it, and then you grab it. Now it's a little glitchy. So far I haven't had any problems with the trees flying though. If I knew how to operate this thing, I'd be a lot quicker. But I, I don't like how it rotates like that. But it's so easy to rotate it. Like instead of, you know, side to side is, is like the rotate up and down is to open and close the grips. I wish they'd map that uh, something else. I guess that's nice, but if you're an experienced user, so it's like that. Let's grab it. Oh. kind of unsettling to see it like, shaking and vibrating so much. It sounds very nice. I like the sounds. Pretty realistic on the sounds. Let's see. Uh, this forest here is kind of not loaded really right up with the uh, pine trees. It's kind of open. Oh, a lot of the stupid uh, birch trees. If I was smart, I would have picked up area that was all pine trees, but, you know, it's the way I roll. Oh, 
did it the wrong way. Okay, I kind of saved it there. That would be fun to come pick these off, these trees up. Right, I can put this all the way out. I mean, no problems. That's pretty impressive, I think. It's interesting the forest equipment always has the uh, sounds for the stick below the boom. I guess that's. I'm, I wasn't holding it too tight there. I guess that's probably why it didn't get all funky and jittery and stuff. But yeah. I don't know how to use this. I like this mod a lot. Let's come over to the uh, Tiger Cat. Tiger Cat is essentially the same thing. I think it's the same head. Still got a lot of details on it. I personally, I kind of like the Tiger Cat better. It's not as, as big. Same way, it got had kind of a pile started up on the road. I don't really think this is what you're supposed to do with them, though. I think you kind of just you know, throw them down right where you cut them. In all the videos that I've seen, the sounds on this thing aren't as nice, but I feel like it just, I don't know, it's just more compact. There's not as big of a tail, I guess you could say. Kind of glitchy there. I think you're supposed to just, you know, fire him down right here and freeze the game in the process, I guess. Oh, like chuck the tree there. I don't think you can cut the worst trees. Let's snip that off here. I love how fast it cuts through these trees, though. You want to just dis do some destruction? That's a machine. Oh, I think it'll do it. I mean, I don't think it's what it's meant for, but... It'll do it. I mean, if you got a field of these burst trees, this thing is the machine for you. Because nothing really else will really cut them. It looks like a machine, like a. A Ponzi won't do it. I mean, maybe these things cut these things in real life. I'm not too sure. I've only seen videos of them doing like the fir trees, pine trees, or whatever. Whoa. Yeah, I can see it. This thing, I think the, the controls are. Same as an excavator. I think on the other, other one, the controls are reversed. I feel like I, I'm much better at driving this one. Oops. Wrong button. Or I, not wrong button. I forgot to hit the button. This one has no driver in the cab, though. It's kind of uh, disappointing, but oh well. Let's 
snip that one. Oh, maybe not. You can kind of get them. You have to get them from the right angle, though. Damn, I just didn't care. I've gone at all these from the wrong angle. Come on, grab it. Oh. Should be able to grab it, though. This one should be a good one. You can hear the John Deere over in the background. Stop running. Come on. Maybe not. Come on. Is this not a cuttable tree? I'm pretty sure this is a cuttable tree. Oh well. Anyways, thanks guys for watching. I actually do really like these mods now that I understand them. But uh, yeah, I'll catch you again in the next video.